from VOA Learning English. This is the Agriculture Report. The United Nations reports that more than 3.3 million people are now experiencing food insecurity in Sudan. That number is expected to rise soon to 4 million. About 11% of the country's estimated 34 million people would be affected. The UN Food and Agriculture Agency, or FAO, says fighting, displacement, and poor harvests prevent many people from receiving food. Roseanne Markasic represents the FAO in Sudan. She says Sudan's harvest has ended early and the amount of locally available food is decreased. She says food support is needed in millions of Sudanese homes. She says conflicts in the Blue Nile, South Kordofan, and Darfur areas have added to food insecurity. Hundreds of thousands of people have fled the violence. Ms. Markasic says poor weather conditions also affect food security. Long, extremely dry periods in Sudan are followed by floods. Low food supplies in parts of Sudan have caused a sudden rise in food prices. Meat prices, for example, are up 84%. Vegetable prices have risen by 40%. And the cost of transporting food has increased by 70%. Conflict in neighboring South Sudan also hurts the food situation. Refugees continue to cross the border and enter camps in Sudan. The FAO official says it is very important to continue to provide the camp populations with seeds and farm supplies. And the refugees need the same when they return home. Ms. Markasic says Sudan needs thousands of metric tons of seed and almost one million agricultural tools. For VOA Learning English, I'm Carolyn Prasuti.